So here we are with restauranter and master chef judge, Marcus Waring. I am so excited to be here with you, so thank you so much. My pleasure, nice to be here. I didn't think I'd be here doing this. That I didn't think. How's your cooking? Back in 2017, I took a big kind of swing at my kitchen and I started baking a lot. I, I was baking a lot of muffins. I think um, okay. the waistbands of my team slightly <laughs> got enlarged during those championships. You've got, yes. your, own, you've got your own apron brand here. You I, know I don't have one of those. My mum is very proud. So what I wanted to do with this mm -hmm. particular dish is have everything that we all buy in supermarkets. We can get some fresh mint if you've not got them in the garden, some basil cress, and I've got some little meringue nests here. Mm -hmm. I heard that they serve us something along the lines of just under like 200,000 portions yes. of strawberries I've a year. I've always got the exact number. I think it's 191,000 and... Uh, there you go. Something. <laughs> so I just went for the just below 200. So just grab a couple of little ones and leave them whole. I'm taking this very seriously looking for the little ones. Like... Okay, so a little bit of a marinade, pasta sugar. Got a little bit of gin. Now, now that you're not playing, are you okay with that? Yes. I, even when I'm playing, I think everything's good in moderation. Good. This might be very strong. So whoever wants a strong one yeah, can right. just come to me. Just... Grab some of this basil and then just get some mint and just pull onto the strawberry, like so. We're at the bottom <laughs> of Hemmond Hill. Now, is it ever going to be um, there, Conta there Hill? There were slight whispers of Conta Cliff, although it sounds very Conta ominous. Cliff. I know, it sounds very ominous, and actually, I wouldn't want to sit on Conta Cliff, to be fair, <laughs> so I'd rather sit on Murray Mound on Hemmond Hill. I'd need to do something very, very special here, hopefully one day, but I think it's very, very much deservedly Hemmond Hill and Murray Mound. We all need inspiring by other people. Oh no, for sure. And that's I why I think agree. we all find lockdown so difficult. Because yes. it's tough when you're isolated. Well, no, there's very, very little human connection. And you yeah. notice when as soon as lockdown lifted slightly, people would actually stop and want to talk to you. And you, <laughs> you could just feel the kind of- Give you a hug. The, yeah, like, <laughs> can I please hug you? Like, oh, from two meters, I feel the virtual it's hug. It's a long way. <laughs> So in that bowl there, I've already poured you some cream. Usually at home, I have a nice electric whisk. Do I need to warm up or anything? No, I'm sure, this is, I'm sure you've got the strength in your arms to whip I, up a little bit of cream. Strength, maybe. Technique, I'm not so sure. Now we can enjoy the best bit, which is dressing the plate. Yes. And making it look really nice. I hear you're local. Is that correct? Yes, I am. I, I live just over there somewhere. <laughs> I am. I've, I've been in Wimbledon now for six years. What I love about it is Wimbledon really takes a lot of time to respect the community. So we all, everybody even outside of the gates feels yes. very much involved with what's going on inside. Yeah. And it's the one event you don't want to finish. No, it just keeps I getting completely better agree. And better. Grab one of the meringue's nests. Yes. And just, just break it up with a knife. And then just place those around the plate. Almost a little bit like eating mess in a way. Just looking at, you know, just looking at my competition there. <laughs> <laughs> Jelly? Jelly. And a spoon. You're just going to put little lumps of them around the plate. Okay. Grab some more basil. Mm -hmm. yes. What you've got now is your cream. Mm -hmm. And you just put a nice big blob of that on top. Now, I don't want anyone to be biased, but... I think that looks <laughs> amazing. In fact, that looks better in a bowl than it does on my plate. I think you won that one. Just purely circumstantial. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing to do with talent.